Robin Hood and the Golden Arrow In the lush green forests of Sherwood, there lived a noble and courageous outlaw known as Robin Hood. Robin and his band of merry men were famous for their acts of justice and their mission to help the poor and downtrodden. One day, word reached Robin Hood that Prince John was hosting a grand archery competition in Nottingham. The prize, a golden arrow, was said to be worth a fortune. The competition was open to all, but Robin sensed that the event was a ruse by the greedy prince to extort money from the common folk. Determined to expose Prince John's true intentions, Robin decided to enter the competition in disguise. With his trusty bow and arrows in hand, he ventured into Nottingham under the guise of a skilled archer named Robert of Loxley. The day of the competition arrived, and the townspeople gathered in the bustling square. Prince John and his entourage took their places, eager to witness the archery skills of the participants. Robin, disguised as Robert, stood among the contestants, his true identity concealed beneath a hood. His heart raced with excitement as he waited for his turn to showcase his skills. Little did Prince John and his men know that they were about to face the greatest archer in all of Sherwood. As the competition began, one by one, the participants took their shots. Some missed the target completely, while others managed to hit the outer rings. But when it was Robin's turn, the air was filled with anticipation. He stepped forward confidently, his fingers caressing the bowstring. His eyes locked on the distant target, he drew back the bow and released the arrow with expert precision. The arrow soared through the air, slicing through the wind, and struck the bullseye with a resounding thud. The crowd erupted in applause, astonished by Robin's incredible display of archery. Prince John, however, looked on with suspicion and annoyance. He had heard whispers of a skilled outlaw hiding in the forest, and he couldn't shake the feeling that this mysterious archer was none other than Robin Hood. To confirm his suspicions, Prince John devised a plan. He declared that the archer who could split Robin's arrow with a shot of their own would win the golden arrow and a generous reward. He hoped to expose Robin's true identity and capture him once and for all. Confident in his abilities, Robin welcomed the challenge. He knew that his skills were unmatched, and he was determined to prove his prowess. One by one, the participants stepped forward, attempting to split Robin's arrow. But try as they might, they fell short of the mark. The pressure mounted, and the crowd grew restless. Just as it seemed that no one could match Robin's feet, a young and unknown archer stepped forward. He was small in stature, but his eyes sparkled with determination. The crowd whispered in uncertainty as the young archer prepared his shot. With unwavering focus, he drew back his bow and let the arrow fly. The arrow whizzed through the air, soaring toward its target. In a miraculous display of skill, the young archer's arrow split Robin's arrow right down the middle, striking the bullseye once again. The crowd gasped in awe, unsure of how such a feat was possible. Robin, intrigued and impressed, approached the young archer. Who are you, young one? he asked. I am Thomas, a simple farm boy, the young archer replied. I have been practicing my archery in secret, hoping to one day join your band of merry men. Robin smiled warmly at Thomas, recognizing the spark of talent within him. You have proven yourself worthy, Thomas. Join us in Sherwood, and together we shall continue to fight for justice and help those in need. Thomas's eyes widened with joy and gratitude. He had idolized Robin Hood and his merry men for years, and now he had the opportunity to stand among them. And so, Robin Hood and his band of merry men welcomed Thomas into their fold, and the legend of their adventures and acts of justice continued to grow. As for the golden arrow, it became a symbol of hope and unity in Sherwood. It was placed in a prominent spot in Robin's camp, reminding all who saw it of the power of courage, skill, and the fight against injustice. And as the tales of Robin Hood and the Golden Arrow spread throughout the land, they inspired countless others to stand up for what is right, proving that even in the face of adversity, a single arrow can change the course of history. The End